Good morning, this is Daily Dose of Complete Health all with your local chiropractor, Patrick Hogg. And I'm going on another seminar this weekend. So I'm gonna be up in Cardiff, across in Cardiff, it's probably across really, it's kind of across and up. Uh, in Cardiff, going through another adjusting seminar and just really diving deep into the levels of connection with emotion and different connections with like, physical uh, and how that starts to then have an impact on our body's ability to communicate through the nerve system. So when we start looking at trauma, people obviously think of trauma very much in the physical sense, but trauma can be both a physical and emotional trauma. And what emotions actually get attached to injuries and traumas? How does it actually make us feel? What does it make us feel when we're feeling down and sore, inflamed, irritated, etc.? Because a lot of people, when they'll come into my office, they'll start using terms like, I feel depressed, or I just, I feel like I've got low energy, or, you know, I'm angry at the fact that I'm just not getting better, I'm, in a, bad, in a lack of words, peed off uh, with the doctors for not really helping me out. And so there's a lot of emotion that gets attached into our physical changes and injuries and ailments. And so it's really having a look at not just the physical side of things, but then what actually starts to happen both energetically and emotionally when we start looking at these things and looking at the capacity that someone's body has for recovery. And when we get into a state of disruption, so when we're angry, when we're peed off, when we're upset, irritated, irritable, just brrr, uh, we start to actually inhibit our capacity to actually function and think and process correctly. And we also basically steal our body's resources for driving up the stress response instead of utilizing that for our recovery response. And it's really simple, you just look at your physiology, right? The easiest way of ever really looking at things is just go back to your physiology textbook and just have a look at how your body reacts to stress. When you're angry, your heart rate starts to increase. When you're angry, your breathing rate starts to increase. When you're angry, your muscle tone starts to increase in your arms and your legs. Your circulation starts directing away from your organs and towards your muscles. If you think about that peak time where someone shouted at you and you were having a full-blown shouting argument with someone back, you will feel the heart rate change, the breathing rate change, the muscle tone change, and that requires a lot of energy from your body. Now, just imagine that's happening on a low grade. That means it's stealing that energy from other places to basically facilitate those processes. And when we, when we talk about energy, you can look at it from a purely physiological point of view. When we look at energy, we can look at how our ATP cycle recycles stuff from oxygen to be able to allow energy to flow in the cell. Now the problem is if we're utilizing all of that energy that our body creates from the nutrients that we absorb to process those changes, it starts to have an impact on how our body feels. It also has an impact on what our body is using its resources for. And I can tell you, if you've got an injury or inflammation, and you're getting angry all the time, or you're, you're getting stressed, or your body is utilizing those, those energies to facilitate other processes, you might not have the energy to then facilitate the healing process, which is why those injuries sometimes don't get better. And this is how chiropractic basically works. It not only does it reduce the physical stress on someone's body, it can start to dampen down those alerts in the brain and allow the body to go into that state of ease so the body can start to recover. It's really simple, guys. Patrick for Complete Health, this is your Daily Dose. Looking forward to seeing you guys again next week after I've had this weekend in Cardiff, all fired up and ready to get people adjusted in the best way we possibly can, in a more connected and just more holistic way so that your bodies can function the best they possibly can. Take care for now, guys.